I'm joined by the Hereford captain, Josh Gowling, after the defeat at Kings Lynn. How disappointing was that for you? <laughs> yeah, I can't really put that into words. We, um, we didn't get really get out of the blocks. Um, we worked on a lot of things during the week and we just didn't put it, implement it on the pitch today. So, yeah, very disappointing. It seemed that everybody was flat and necessarily didn't have that drive and enthusiasm we've come to expect recently. No, I don't, I don't think it's that. Obviously, the lads, you know, you don't go on, on, onto a pitch and not want to win and not want to do things and not run around. We just kind of lost our way a little bit. And um, that's down to us on the pitch. It's down to us organising, myself organising on the pitch. So it's just disappointing. What, what can you put it to, down to in terms of the, you know, the passing wasn't quite flowing as crisply uh, as you would have liked? We're still in transition, aren't we? We've had a lot of changes. Um, put it down to that. But at the end of the day, it's, it's about accountability. That's one of the things that we touched upon in pre-season. And it's about being brave on the ball, wanting the ball and working. And well, I don't think we did that well enough today. It was the same for both teams with a really swirling wind. Um, as as defender, you would probably find that difficult to cope with. <laughs> I've played in some uh, bit crazy um, conditions before, so no. But at the end of the day, we tried to get the ball down and play. We knew we couldn't necessarily go long, you know, long ball up to the big man because because of, of the wind. But we just weren't good enough on the ball. Simple as that today. What what do you think you can change quickly? Because you've obviously these games come thick and fast at the start of the season what, what can you do to turn it around well, we've, got, we've got to change a lot um, I think we've got to be better in the transition when we're attacking so when the ball breaks down getting back into our shape early and then pressing together I think that's something we've been working on and we didn't do today um, we've got to be a bit more kind of positive on the ball and, and you know just yeah just, just, just be that little bit more positive and, and get into positions a bit earlier work harder off the ball to get in those positions to give yourself a bit of space so well, you know we've been working on in training all week so there's no excuse we just didn't implement it today because it was noticeable that Kings Lynn got their wing backs forward especially in the first half yeah is that something that, that Hereford really ought to be looking at yeah I mean if you look at the Gloucester game we got our wing backs forward didn't we so I think it was just one of those games where they kind of pinned our full backs back a bit and you know we, we kind of didn't really get our game going so I think they kind of imposed their will a bit more than what we did. What do you think we can do from here on in? Is there a points target maybe uh, in the first 10 games something like that or is it match to match? No I mean we, we've got an idea where we want to be what we want to do so it's definitely not that so <laughs> but no we, we'll, um, it's the third game of the season we know where we want to be and what we've got to do so we've just got to turn it around it's not the end of the world we're going to lose games this season so that is what it is but you know we've just got to learn from this we'll watch we'll do some analysis with the gaffer and we'll put it right thanks for time no problem